Hey everyone, Patrick Ellis, uh, President and CEO of the Myriad Waldemar Chamber of Commerce here. Just wanted to give you guys a quick update before I jump on another uh, webinar conference call, uh, as I'm sure a lot of you guys are doing as of late. Um, I know a lot of you have heard that as of today, a lot of things have changed regarding the IDLE loan program and the PPP program. Uh, I just want you to be aware of we're, we're kind of monitoring this, but if you haven't heard, uh, uh, unfortunately, our legislators in D.C. did not anticipate as many people applying for these loans and these uh, paycheck protection programs. Um, and so they are looking to add more funding in. But uh, because of that um, short sightedness, unfortunately, a lot of us are going to pay the price uh, in what is probably delays and uh, not getting everything that everyone's looking for right now. So um, they've put a cap on the idle loans right now. No one can get a loan of over uh, $15,000 right now, um, which for a lot of people is, is, is a huge, huge challenge. So, um, but there is a push, uh, was on a call with the U.S. Chamber of Commerce this afternoon talking about it. Um, and hopefully there will be a lot of movement in the next few days, uh, at least the beginning of next week. Um, there is discussion going on about getting uh, money back into the program. So if you have applied, um, don't think if you get the 15000 that that's it. That is um, what they're capping it at as of now. Um, I think the unfortunate part from a personal standpoint is, is that there are those that got some of those loans in the beginning and got some large amounts um, and then those of us who are a little further back in line are probably not going to get as much now. Um, my understanding is the discussions that are happening with the U.S. Chamber and our legislators is that, that they are that chances are the funding will be replenished. And so you will see that uh, come back in. The loans will come back out. And so even if you only get 15000 in the beginning, you should get more um, or a larger amount of what you were looking for um, once those kind of uh, revenue streams get uh, replenished. Um, same as with the, the PPP, uh, that program right now is... Um, at capacity and so they're looking for funding to come in for that as well um, at this point right now my understanding is the idle loans they are not even accepting anymore at this point um, so as we get more information I will get that out to you um, that's kind of the latest that I've heard um, and uh, hopefully uh, we'll see some more coming from our state as well there are some programs already in place but I don't know if you guys heard or saw that or not um, but just so you know, there's a flash flood warning just came up on my phone. Um, but that's that's Facebook Live for you. Um, so I just wanted to make sure that you guys are kind of aware of that. Um, we're monitoring it as closely as we can. Um, as soon as I've got any more information, I'll get that out to you. So whether that's later today or on Monday. Um, but just uh, keep watching for our Facebooks, our, uh, all of the information on our website. And we'll get you uh, everything we can as much as possible. So... Um, keep in tune. I know this is a real trying time. Um, the one thing that I can try to encourage you to do, um, and it's really hard with what's going on, but is, is just try to be patient. Um, uh, there are wheels in motion. It's just going to take a little bit longer, you know, bureaucracy and the way that works. So, uh, hang in there. Uh, as I always say is, is if you guys need anything, you have questions, whatever, reach out to any one of us, myself, Heather, Rhonda, Kim, Mike, we're all here for you. We want to help you uh, manage this as best we can. Um, and just know we're working every day to kind of make sure we got your backs and, and, and setting things up for when uh, things do re-engage and the doors do open again, um, as slow as that might be, um, that we're going to help with kind of creating plans to make sure you're all successful as much as possible when that happens. So hang in there. Um, reach out for help and, and we'll be here for you. So thanks signing off uh, so I can get on and do another call. All right. Have a good day, guys.